Now, I don't know if you guys can tell, but uh, I like JoJo, and today was a very, very good day for JoJo fans out there. Okay, now before I start talking about anything or bringing up any of the information and stuff like that, I just want to make things perfectly clear right now that all the information, the leaks, the news that I'm going to be talking about, they're fairly new. Like, they have been revealed and surfaced in, like, the past couple of days. So, this is like, there's a cause to be concerned. There is a reason to be hyped because there is some pieces of information out there that, you know, it heavily, heavily alludes to JoJo Part 6 Stone Ocean finally getting animated at long last. Now, y'all know I love Part 5, right? Y'all know if y'all watch my Part 5 reactions, I fucking love Part 5. I love Best Mom Bruno. I love Giorno's crazy ass, man. I love JoJo in general now. So, now that I heard this news, I had to talk about it. So, you know, I spend my time gathering all this information, you know, trying to gather up all in one place so that you guys can be in the loop in case you guys aren't in the loop because most of this information is from Twitter. You know, various sources, various reliable sources that have influence in like the JoJo community and stuff like that have been talking about it and I just want to gather it all today and present it to you guys. So the first and actually the biggest and newest piece of information that we have is this JoJo event that is supposedly scheduled for April of next year 2021. This has been discovered on the JoJo Portal website. Now you guys might be wondering, okay JoJo Portal website, hold on, let me go check that shit out. So if you guys go to it right now, most likely you're going to be met with this like username and password, you're like locked out and stuff like that, right? And that's totally normal because obviously the website is not supposed to be public, like it's not supposed to be officially released yet. A bunch of people got into the website, you know, because it was open and a bunch of people made a bunch of screenshots, they took a lot of videos. And basically, it was confirmed that the website is real. Like, if you go on it, it has all these animations on it. It's legitimate. It's the same for everybody because it was a cause for concern that, okay, maybe the screenshot was fake. But, you know, now that people were able, multiple people, I would say, multiple people were able to get into the website and, you know, see all this stuff. It has been confirmed that this website is real. So if you guys are wondering what this JoJo Portal site is, it's actually this new domain that Warner Brothers themselves officially registered and like I said before, it's closed, like it's supposed to be locked, it's supposed to be private, but apparently it was opened up for a little bit and some people got in, able to take screenshots and videos, which I will show on the screen right now, of people going in there, you can see all the animations and stuff like that, and you can see all the dates. I guess for certain stuff and of course like the biggest one where it sees you know it shows all the Jojo protagonists from part one through five and it says the next Jojo event April 2021st coming soon now this event is actually labeled as a animation special event which can only mean two things in my mind one they're gonna announce Stone Ocean part six at this event two they announce Purple Haze feedback with Fugo, which, yo, I love Fugo, don't get me wrong, yo, I, I, you know, I love part 5 and shit like that, I love Fugo, but I feel like it would make more sense that Stone Ocean does get revealed here, since, like, I guess this whole event, the theme is, like, inherit, inheriting the soul of the Joestar, and also there has been some, like, I guess, coincidental little, like, easter eggs here, where, like, April 4th is the day the Joe Stars Inherited Soul event is being held. April 4th is also the day the first part three episode aired. So Jolene, which is the part six protagonist, if you don't know, uh, possibly gets her part announced the day her father's first episode airs, which is really cool. Honestly, like if that's like the marketing strategy for David Productions and shit like that, like that's that's actually really cool. And April 4th is actually Jonathan's birthday as well. Like the first Jojo, which makes sense, which ties in to the whole inheriting the soul thing. Do you get me now? So like I said, this is the newest and biggest piece of information we have is this Jojo event that is supposed to go on April 4th, 2021 of next year now like i said before stone ocean itself has not been confirmed there is still a slight chance that it might be something else like purple haze feedback so like i said you know I, there's a reason to get hype but also keep your expectations in check you know i've been waiting for part six for a long ass time i mean goddamn, dude i got a picture of jolene here i got a picture of jolene right there you guys can probably see her bro and like yo I haven't even, <laughs> uh, but if you guys don't know, I'm an anime only, so I have, I only know part one through five, but you know, Jolene looks dope. I'm ready for it when it comes out. Don't get me wrong. I'm ready. So there, like I said, there is a cause 
to be hyped right now. Now, another piece of information out there is actually an animator that previously worked on the JoJo animes before. Her name is Megumi Itoi. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Um, she tweeted out, and I mean, I, I, I guess she didn't really mean to do this, but like, she tweeted out that she was like, oh, she was working on a lot of projects, and one of them happened to be JoJo, and she was talking about, oh, you know, changing art styles is always such a hard thing, and you know, if you know JoJo, JoJo is known for changing their art, art style as they go through all the parts, you know, part three and part four and part five, they all have different art styles and stuff like that, so that kind of you know, jumbled up the, the JoJo community like, okay, okay, she might have leaked something and she might be working on something and all we can do really is wait though, but all, all I'm hoping for is of course a Stone Ocean anime adaptation being announced April 2021 of next year. But yeah guys, that's honestly basically it in terms of all the new information and this is new, like big information, like this information was like, it got revealed like a, what like a couple hours ago like i'm recording this at like what like almost midnight right now but like goddamn it got revealed like eight hours ago or something like that right so this is big news like this is huge news it's like the leaks are real it's been the website's been confirmed real but all we're hoping for now like all we need is official you know publicly released information about stone ocean so until then all we can do is wait guys, you know, I'm gonna be covering this, you know, I, I, I wanna stay in the loop with this, so you know, if any news pops up that I deem worthy of letting you guys know, um, I'll talk about it here, and of course, whenever Stone Ocean, the, whenever the JoJo event, you know, comes, I'll, I'll probably stream the JoJo event, honestly, whenever it, you know, pops up and stuff like that, and we can see, our, you know, we can see together if Stone Ocean gets announced, or Purple Ace Feedback, or another Rohan OVA, which... Uh, I mean, that would be cool, I guess. But all I can say right now, guys, is keep your expectations in check. You know, you can get excited. You can get hyped. As you can see, I'm hyped right now. I'm, obviously, I have to let you guys know. Like, I'm not no fucking insider news source, you know? Like, I'm just a JoJo fan like you, getting my information, and I'm just trying to collect it into this video right now and let you guys know. But like I said, keep your expectations in check, just so your heart doesn't get broken in case it's not what you expect bars accidentally but yeah guys make sure to leave a like and subscribe because we're really close to hitting 50,000 subscribers it's really easy really simple it takes like one second to click the subscribe button so yeah go ahead and do that for your boy but guys i'm hyped i'm excited to see what this jojo event has in store for us next year because this year has been shit but you know jojo always makes things better so i'm excited hopefully stone ocean next year guys it's been your boy ivory I'm, and i'm out peace